Suppose that in my home, in the AC panel, the capacity of that panel is five kilowatts, 5,000 watts, that's the power. I want to fit that panel with my inverter. What should be the, the output capacity of that inverter to fit the panel? 5,000, because the panel is 5,000. Of course, if I have a, an inverter 7,000, will be better. You understand? Okay, suppose that I am going to install a 5,000 inverter because I need 5,000 kilowatts in my AC panel. This is my inverter. This is the output AC, AC signal. That's clear, guys? And this is the input DC current. In the output, I wanted 5,000 watts. The input are the batteries. The batteries connected in series, in parallel, and as I'm pan, 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 pan. I don't know how many batteries I need. Okay, this is the group of batteries that I provide power here, DC, positive and negative, and the inverter convert in AC, and this is the output. Only for common sense. How much should be the power of this group of batteries in order to convert and uh, in the other side produce 5,000? Minimum 5,000. I need the power DC 5,000. But really, 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 in the process of conversion, you lose. You lose. This is why you put 5,000 plus 20%. This is the power that you require. 